Hello folks, it's Phil here, founder of Digital DJ Tips, with an, a rather unusual video. I've just got home from our, our second to last planning day for the Digital DJ Masterclass 2015 free training event. So if you don't know what that is, every year we do a week's free training, video training, downloads, and all your tutors, including me, uh, online and in the training event to, to help you answer questions and so on. And at the end of that training event, we open our Digital DJ Masterclass, which is our flagship best training course, to a very limited number of students just for a short period uh, for that year's intake of students. Uh, so I'm just back from the training uh, planning from the Digital DJ Tips HQ. The staff are all very excited. They're still there working now. And um, I just got to thinking in the car on the way home, you know, can, how can I go back and pin where all this started? Can I go back and find out what it was that made me follow this route to teach people to DJ and I, I think I nailed it and I just want to share it with you in, in this quick video because I think it's important. Um, I was nine years old and I used to listen to a little radio under my bed, uh, under my pillow in bed when my parents thought I was asleep and I used to, I was obsessed with pop music as I'm sure a lot of kids are, I'm sure you can remember your first, uh, you know, tuning into the charts experiences as well but I remember this one moment, it was one song, it was Kid Creole and the Coconut Stool Pigeon which is quite a funky song. Uh, and I just, it just, something snapped inside me. I just, I, w I wasn't there anymore. I wasn't lying in that bed anymore. I was somewhere exciting and glamorous and, and very different. Uh, the song had literally just, just taken me away. And uh, I was amazed at the power that music could have over me. And I wanted to share it. I wanted to share that feeling. Uh, and that, I think, is where it started. That's where I think I, I got that passion and that click for DJing from. And, um, I was a usual teenager, you know, making mixtapes for girlfriends, playing parties and so on. And then my DJ career, I was lucky enough to, to, to have a DJ career, went into weddings and corporate events and then and bar DJing and then finally promoting my own night, which is what I really wanted to do. Uh, I promoted a night for 10, 15 years and I um, booked most of my DJing heroes, played with a lot of my heroes, uh, played at Privilege and Ibiza, the main room of the biggest club in the world. You know, I, I, uh, and everything I have um, has come from my DJing career. I'm very, very thankful for that. But the burning passion that I have is to share that with other people and to help people who feel that about music and who want to share the music they love to do it through DJing. And that is where the core belief of this company, that's where it all came from. And that's why we're really excited as a company to welcome you onto the Digital DJ Masterclass free training event with the possibility of grabbing one of those places on our limited course, which opens for a week at the end of this event. Uh, so uh, we'll see you on Wednesday for that. I hope if you're not a member of the site, sign up. There's a link below where you can join for free. And that means we can email you and let you know when all the new lessons are launched throughout the next week. It's going to be a really busy week uh, and we're all going to really uh, be, be grinding out our 12 and 15 hour days. But just in this calm moment before all that started, I just felt the need to share with you uh, kind of where it all came from. Uh, so thanks for watching and uh, yeah, hope to see you in about 48 hours from now for the launch of Digital DJ Masterclass free training event 2015.